For decades, the rural nature of ranching and water access on the Navajo Nation has led to challenges with overgrazing. But now a new tech-focused effort between a New Mexico business and Sandia Labs is helping tackle that problem. News 13's Bianca Hoops spoke with the leaders who are making it happen. The ranchers are so rural and remote that, uh, you know, it's, it was hard for them to haul water and they've been doing this for decades. Relying on old technology has made hard work for New Mexico ranchers on the Navajo Nation across generations. Farmers have relied on old windmills to draw water from the ground in remote locations, while cattle walk miles to get a drink or farmers haul that water to them. The problem is, is they have vast land and lots of grasses that are not at that location, so they overgraze that area and that water needs to be distributed. And the way to do that requires a lot of engineering. Sandia National Labs recently partnered with New Mexico State University to help a small New Mexico company build new technology to help. Remote Solutions planned, designed, and installed this innovative off-the-grid water system. This is all automated. It's, it's solar only. There's no batteries. There's no... There's, there's no transmitters, no receivers, no radios. It's, it's, um, it's all solar. Owner Mike Liss says under their system, water is pumped into a storage tank, then distributed throughout the land using a remote-controlled system with a gravity-fed network of piping. It was the project former Navajo Nation Vice President Myron Leiser pushed for and got funded through a $25 million federal grant. What really helped that early on was I knew the ranchers. They were there in the first meeting. They were like, we support this already. Four systems have now been installed across San Juan and McKinley counties. Some of them have gotten very emotional. And when you see a 60-year-old man get emotional because that whole burden is gone, um, yeah, it, it's taken a, it, it's, it's gone a lot deeper than just a business effort. It's very rewarding. Bianca Hoops, Kirikui, News 13. The Navajo Nation looking to install 33 more of these solar water systems over the next few years, while the Laguna Pueblo is also hoping to install two systems by May.